Uh, defense played well enough to, to win, and offense just shot themselves in the foot, just didn't execute very well. And probably a little bit had to do with Old Dominion, but uh, you know, not very often you go to a game and no turnovers. And I thought their drive, but we gained some momentum in the second half and pinned the ball in the five, and then he drove it down. And our guy did a great goal line stand. But the field position, we couldn't get out of there. And, you know, um, um, you know, they made a big call on the third and seven, which would hold the field goal, and that makes it a two possession game. So we uh, need to get back to work and um, got a short week and get ready for Temple. What was the goal, the goal line stand followed by you guys not making the first down? Did that, was that kind of a backbreaker, not only for the field position, but your defense had been on the, on the field for, for a while? Yeah, they got, you know, they drove the, but that, that, the drive was a big, you know, credit them, they, they, you know. We had the one fumble, but there wasn't any replay. They fumbled the ball, and so there wasn't a replay today. It was the first time that's ever happened, Division One. But uh, that, that series was big. It flipped the field, and, and our guys showed a lot of resolve. The defense guys, you know, f you know, they can run the ball pretty well, and they get good running backs. So we held them on fourth down, and, uh, you know, Ross missed maybe a throw there, but, uh, um, you know, we just didn't get it out. And then they made a big play on the third and seven. We could use a timeout to see what they're going to be in. They ran that, the, the zone read with the quarterback, and he hit it. And, you know, so if we're holding a field goal there, I think it's different. So a couple big plays when you got a close game. They made the plays, we didn't. Has, has the offensive line, is, is that a hard thing to to fix a little bit, given that uh, how, how well they got to Andrew and how much you guys struggled to, to get momentum running the ball? Yeah, we didn't. We didn't play very well up front. Um, you know, when Raekwon, you know, that was a big hold. We had a 20 yard right before the half. Andrew scrambled for 20 yards and we got a hold and then Raekwon gets a couple at the end of the half. He lost his mind a little bit, but he's competing. And, um, you know, so, uh, yeah, I, I, as I said, we had to, I felt like they were coming together. I thought in the second half, we started coming together and, and um, you know, we had the fourth, we had the third down, and Ross just missed Jesse. He's going to make that catch, you know, uh, on the slant, and uh, that's a first down. And we punted the ball, and down there, I felt I felt good about where we're at, the way the defense was playing, and they just had the 90, 95 yard drive, 94 yard drive, and flipped the field, and, and we couldn't get, get out of there. Adam played, but not as effective as he's been. Was he 100 percent? I mean, was he close to 100 percent or 100? I mean, he didn't get hurt again, but he didn't practice all week, so. We weren't sure of the game plan and stuff that way, and uh, but he was all right. He, Wait, what's the status of uh, Isaiah Rudd? Is he you missed him for a good chunk of time? Yeah, he, he came, back he came in and, and fielded a punt at the end, yeah. so he came back. Yeah, I, I don't think anybody Jack Driscoll went out, which hurt us a little bit in the fourth quarter because you know, with their ends are, are good players, and we had to go to some chip schemes and think that way to protect yeah. on the edge. Um, but that, that you know, um, but he should be, he'll be fine. Is it oversimplifying it when you, to to say that when Adam came out at the end of the coastal in the coastal game, the offense struggled after that. You said you weren't sure if you were going to play him today. You know how much he could play today, and the offense struggled somewhat today. Was is, is his was his presence are you missing in the in the offense as far as your, your ability to? Change? Yeah, I, I mean, you know, I think it wasn't only him, but but. Um, I, I thought our guys were prepared. I, I credit their guys. Our plan wasn't very good. We got a couple. He got a couple hits early. And, you know, just never got the rhythm that we needed to get. And um, you know, and Adam. You know, we tried to get him the ball a little bit in there, but um, you know, we we just missed on some. I didn't see the, the stats. The third downs were were not great, but we're just looking for that one spark. You know, it's it's the defense played well, and you need, you know, it's been 11 quarters without a takeaway. That's the longest I've ever seen, and I've coached for a long time, and it's probably going to just come. I just think if that one fumble, you know, spark us, it's it's that way. But um, um, you know, no turnovers in the game. We didn't turn the ball over. Was a good thing, but took took a couple sacks. We didn't need it to. And um, as I said, we got a 
shorten it up sometimes, it's good to just have a short week. That's what we got. Did what what specifically? The replay? Uh, uh, I just said it wasn't there. Remind me of last time that happened was in Miami. I mean, uh, Miami, Ohio, when it was off, when it wasn't a fumble, but it's not just, I don't know. I don't know what they just, I didn't ask about it. What you said you were looking for a spark. Did you think you, you, you had it when Isabella? Yeah, I did. Spent I thought we came out of the halftime. We've done it three times now, John. Yeah. Yeah. I scored a touchdown. Coming out of the halftime, it's a one possession game. It's a field goal game. And as I said, we went back and forth and got the ball to the 40 yard line and punted it down to the five. And the momentum was ours. And then you credit, credit them. They went 95 yards. They, they made plays. And, um, you know, we just didn't get it. And I said that the, the, uh, the, the fumble there would have been a big, big spark. You know, and you just get confidence, you know. The guys played hard and played the way they've been practicing. Um, proud, of, proud of their efforts, both sides. And just got to go back and practice better and get, and get better and make, make some more plays. What specifically were you pleased with about the way the defense played? Well, I thought they ran to the ball. I thought it was something we talked about. I thought they were a little more physical. You know, their running back's really good. Now, Lowry didn't play, but Cox is a really good player. And, you know, we hit him pretty good. And, you know, quarterback got out early. You know, Steve Casale comes clean and misses the guy. You know, um, that wasn't great. But, um, you know, we played well enough on defense to, to win the game. You know, it's not, you know, just uh, they, 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 I think they'll gain confidence. Now the offense has got to go back. Got to get both sides to play well together. You know, and that's we're trying to talk about it. I like this team as much as any since I've been here, and and uh, you know, I just got to keep them up. We just got to get ready for Friday night. Thank you, coach.